guys, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be all about swap shops. So I thought I would quickly show you the things that I'm going to take to my swap shop on Saturday and then I'll film a bit there and show you the things that I got. So first I've got this wraparound red cord skirt that I got in a charity shop. Then I've got this flowery white um, drop hem kind of scuba -y style skirt from Primark. This is a Topshop scuba skirt in a lovely bright blue. And then I've got this black and white blouse with a kind of snow leopard print on um, that I got in a charity shop and I've done a blog post on that I'll link to below. I've got this Abercrombie and Fitch burgundy top that I've worn quite a bit. I think I might have got it at a swap shop or I was given it by a friend, um, but it's not really my style anymore. It's a bit too simple. So I thought this would be a really nice one to swap because it's a brand. Then I've got a black and white houndstooth peplum, also from Primark, um, that I thought would be a fun one. I've worn it a bit, but I'm trying to be a bit less monochrome at the moment. And then the last top is this black and white striped with Ryland blouse, which has got a nice dipped a uh, different coloured hem, which is really cute, but better for someone who's got a more formal job than me and needs it for the office. Then a bright blue sparkly sweater that I've worn a bit, but is a tiny bit too scratchy for me. Another blue is this blue silk H&M play suit. I've worn this absolutely loads, so I think it's a good one to swap because I can pass it on to someone who'll really love it and carry on wearing it. I've got these black and white houndstooth trousers that are just really comfortable, very light. I bought them out in Thailand just because I needed some extra more light trousers to wear, but now that I'm home, I've actually got quite a few that I probably should have taken with me to Thailand originally. Then second last, I've got this top shop um, jumpsuit which is a really nice strappy kind of slightly silky jumpsuit with big long legs um, I got this at a car boot sale in Pimlico which I'll also link to um, it's a really awesome purchase it only cost me a couple of pounds and I've worn it a lot but now I'm ready to clear out and move on to the next thing and finally this dress which has a really cute deer print it's a kind of brocade fabric pink skirt which I also got in Thailand but it's just slightly too small for me and if I'm honest I'm not going to wear it because it's not that comfortable because it's cut to Asian sizes. So as hopefully you've noticed I've tried to bring things that are really nice, things that I still like and I still would be happy for someone to swap with me but stuff that I'm just not really wearing that much. So if you're going to a swap shop don't take really junky stuff, take nice stuff that you would be happy to take from someone as well but things that you've moved on from or aren't quite right for your style right now. Hello, so welcome back. Now I'm going to show you the stuff that I got at the swap shop. It will probably not surprise you to know that I got more than I took with me. Every time I go, I'm like, I'm going to take loads, get rid of lots, and then I just come back with an absolute ton. So I'm going to try and go through them really quickly because I don't want this video to get crazy long. So here we go. First, I got this gorgeous top from River Island. It's really silky and it's got at least three different prints on it. So the sleeves and the back are this chevron. The front is a big kind of Aztec and then the bottom is a little kind of blue and gold trim. It's absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Can't believe someone was getting rid of it. The next top is from Next. Oh, <laughs> and um, I guess this shows a lot about thrifting, how you should ignore the sizes because this is a 12. I would normally wear an eight, but it's got this really cute polka dot heart print and inside the heart there's little birds um, it's got ruffly sleeves and then it's got a kind of dropped skirty hem which I absolutely love the dropped hem stuff at the moment it's so pretty on very relaxed quite long it's really nice just over like leggings with a strappy top underneath and I think it's adorable and quite unusual this one has got to be my favorite find of the whole swap shop it's from Whistles. I mean, I feel kind of bad that I took loads of like H&M and Topshop stuff and took away Whistles, but that's the magic of swap shops, is this top. So it's got a V-neck kind of front and back. It's black and white with like a blue speckle in the black. And then it's got these um, like draped pockets at the bottom. So it just hangs really beautifully. It's all pleated across. It fits like an absolute dream and I'm in love with it. The last two tops are just really simple little basics. The first one is from New Look. It's just a little baby pink stringy strappy top and it's got a double hem which I really like so it kind of moves really beautifully. I love a bit of chiffon, love some baby pink. This was a gorgeous find. And then the final top is just a simple Florence and Fred white luxe t-shirt. It's got a slightly um, longer hem at the front than the back, that really sweet like t-shirty scooped hem. It's just a really brilliant basic. I'm gonna probably wear this all the time. 
And then I got one dress, which is this dress from TFNC, um, and it's fully beaded. The back is just plain and the front is silver beading all over. The person who um, swapped it had bought it for a like flappers 20s themed party and never worn it again but for me this is the kind of stuff I wear all the time. I'm gonna see if I can dress it down for day maybe with a polo underneath like a turtleneck um, but if not it'll certainly be a good evening outfit or for a wedding or a posh lunch or something. Then another amazing label, these girls were so generous with their donations, is these rice trousers. Um, they only just fit me, they were too small for most people so I got lucky. Um, and they are high waisted, bright green like skinny cigarette pants. They look so nice on, they hug in just all the right places and they're really gorgeous like statement block colour spring staple. And then finally, I got two waistcoats. I got this one, which is actually one of my favorites. I've worn this a lot already. It's a pinstripe one. What I really like about it is that the stripes are actually baby pink, so they're not quite so officey. Um, and I tend to wear it with my leather trousers um, and just a plain top, keep it really simple. You, I definitely like long sleeves coming out when it's a waistcoat rather than short sleeves. Um, but now that it's getting a little bit warmer, I can quite often get away without a coat and just wear this instead and I absolutely love it. It's a longer length, so it's really, really flattering and just a little bit fun. And then finally, something which everyone else was not interested in but I was immediately drawn to is this fluffy waistcoat. Um, it's not made of fur, I think it's just kind of wool, it's not even really faux fur, um, but it's really, really textured, really ruffly, um, sleeveless again, it's from Traffic People, and it's so snuggly and so fun. Again, I wear it over a, a white long sleeve turtleneck, something like that, quite simple. With this, you want to keep it simple, maybe some ripped jeans, um, and it's such a fun, like, Saturday weekend shopping outfit. I'm really happy with this. So I really hope that that whirlwind tour has inspired you to either go to a swap shop or even host one. It's really very easy to host a swap shop. You just invite your friends around, put all the clothes on the floor and see what unfolds. It's really, really great fun and I would highly recommend it. Please do comment below if you've been to a swap shop or what your favourite finds were from my things today. Um, and of course, like and subscribe. I love it when you guys subscribe. It means the absolute world to me. I'm really trying to grow my channel. Um, and I will see you with another video again, Tuesday at 6pm, as always. Thank you so much for watching. Bye! Good morning, guys. So I'm here with Paige Joanna. I will link to her channel below. And we're going to a cover cell, Battersea Cover Cell in London. And then we're going to take you around and then do a little look before you. Yeah. Let's get started. Yeah.